baby. Get it. I just had the ability to do whatever I thought was cool in art. Oh, I just enjoyed art in general, so, and then, yeah, I just thought I was a writer, so I just took that as an option. clay and paint as well so it's not all just based around your drawing skills. I think it does help but obviously it's like all about learning because you get more marks for like seeing how you progress and seeing how you get better. Yeah like it's there is a lot of work and like coursework and it all like goes towards your GCSE so it's not like you can just mess around it's quite serious. Um, well when you're doing your coursework there's a lot more freedom because you're not in an exam environment. So you can, you can just feel a bit more relaxed when you're doing it. But when it comes to the exam, it's obviously you've got the element of pressure, but it doesn't feel as pressurised because you've just done so much coursework that you're really prepared for it. Um, so when you get into the mocks and stuff, you have a lot of freedom to choose what types of um, art you want to do. For example, I can't do um, human form to save my life, but I, I love drawing buildings, and so um, my art teacher has sort of given me the freedom to do that and pursue what interests me in art. I'd say that if you're willing to put in the time and effort and you feel like you really are going to enjoy art, then definitely take it on because it is something which you've got to be prepared to put in a lot of effort out of school as well, but it's all worth it and it's quite a nice lesson to have because it's a break from all the really academic subjects and it can really help. to have a camera at home. It doesn't matter what like what camera it is as long as you have one. It's a, it's a nice subject to do and you can just get on with it and get your head into it. Whereas with other subjects there's a lot more coursework. And even though it's like called coursework, it's kind of like fun. Um it goes quite well because I do catering as well and so it sort of ties in when we did food photography. Um, it's quite a lot of sort of like um, coursework so um, you have to balance your time quite easily but at the same time it's quite, um, it's quite relaxing after you've just had, if you take really hard subjects it's quite nice. 